Greetings and welcome back to Grow Empire Rome. So I did a video on this game and there did seem to be some interest in it. So I figure why don't we do another one and see if that interest grows. So we ended the first video by getting a new unit. We have this peasant here who has a pitchfork who apparently is very good against cavalry but not so good against ranged. We haven't really seen range from our enemies, but I'm guessing we're going to start seeing them. So I guess I'm going to have options in terms of deployment. So I have some money. Apparently I've been generating revenue from the places we've captured the, over here on the map. Uh, we'll probably be over here again. I'd like to advance a little bit here, maybe get back into the swing. And um, I'm thinking, why don't we grab some archers? So I'm thinking yeah, another archer over here wouldn't be too bad, right? Okay, there we got another archer. We're close to being able to get another one. So one thing is I think a mistake I was making is I was rushing out to meet our enemies. And basically they weren't in range of the archers then. So I'm going to let them get a little bit closer before I do that. So why don't we just do the next wave and see how that works out. All right. And I do have these guys here. All right, what's going on here? Anytime now. Okay, uh, we're going to send him out. All right. Okay, they're good against ranged. All right, we'll send another group of them out. Okay, could you guys back up? A okay, I leveled apparently. All right, we're sending another group of them out. I'm going to send the pitchfork dudes out next. Okay, you keep running back, keep running back. Let the archers do their job. Yeah, I wish I had that kind of control here, you know? All right, here, send some pitchfork dudes out, because why not? I wish I could call them back. Oh, you know what, I forget. I was forgetting to use the ballista up there, you know? Okay, by the way, we can do some more archers. I mean, they're nowhere near the walls so far. So, yeah, I'm thinking we just add another archer. All right, we'll leave the archers go for now. Oh, actually, I can do the tower and the wall. Okay, I'm just going to spend all of my money. All right, oh, general, I got an exclamation point. Oh, did I get... All right, so I got experience. So can I upgrade this or maybe grab this one? Okay, requires level 12. I can't do that one. What about these other ones? All right, what is this? Tower's damage. Okay, so that increases the damage of the tower. Wall archer's range. I kind of like that one. All right, what is this one? Wall archer's damage. Well, you know, if they're not hitting, what good is it, right? Oh, gold point. Oh, that's... Increasing the amount of gold long term might be a really good idea, you know. Uh, gold per kill, that's not so bad. Experience per kill. You know, that's probably the best one because it'll mean I get more experience so that I can actually get more of these things, right? All right, what do we have over here? Okay, so this is a boost for the melee soldiers. Increased damage there. And the unit, oh, the unit countdown, the cooldown, reducing it. All right, I'm thinking, why don't we do this? Do I have more then? Yes, I do. I'm thinking this is a good one right here, because that means that I can get um, the troops out quicker, right? Let me think. Um, I can't do those. Wall archers, wall archer range. Why don't we just spend all of them and we just do that? Right, it's probably a tragic mistake, but I'm just going to do that. All right, let's do another wave. All right, what do we got coming over here? I'm just going to send a group of soldiers out. That way things will start. Oh, you got uh, you got your own pitchfork there, don't you? Okay, could you guys stay in the range of the um, the archers? That would be. Could you not do that? Okay, I would really like it if you guys would here have some of those. Yeah, here's a situation where I'd really like to pull them back because they're out of range of the archers now. Okay. Damage boost. Shoot the ballista. 
Okay, that was nowhere near them. Yeah, I mean, this is a situation where I'd really like control because the thing about it is the archers are completely out of this now. If these guys would just run up here and stay there, it would be great. You know, if I could just have them do that. Here, have some pitchfork dudes. Yeah, I mean, I think that's kind of a big problem here. It, I, it, I deployed them here, but, you know, if they stayed, like, in the middle there, that would be great because the archers could help. The archers can't do anything if they run all the way over here, you know? All right, let's just do another wave. Uh, I'm not going to spend anything at the moment because I think I'm going to let the money ride a bit. All right, what do we got going here? All right, we got this guy, so we'll send some of them out. And if you guys could just hang out by those flags, that'd be great. Actually, did I even need to send anybody? Okay, just stay there. They'll come to you. Okay, fire. Okay, and yeah, send some more out. See, they're, they're out of the archer's range now. I mean, if they would give me some kind of instruction that I could use... Okay, do some of that and send the pitchfork guys out just in case. Because I'm not seeing any... Um... Yeah, I mean, if they would just move up a little, that would be really great. Yeah, you really need that kind of control there, don't you? I mean, we're winning so far, but I could see that long-term being frustrating, you know? All right, so what do we got here? See, here's the problem. The tower isn't really hitting them. The archers can't reach them, and they're nowhere near the wall. So it's a little hard to say what I need to invest in, you know? All right, what about units, though? All right, I'm getting close to being able to upgrade the peasant. Of course, I'm not really using him very much. But I think upgrading the units probably is the best idea. So we'll do, we'll do one or two more, and then we'll go see about capturing something here, right? You know, maybe I'm better off to just let these individuals run into the um, the archers. I mean, I mean like that. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, now we're doing that. Okay, so throw him. See, there's the ideal situation right there. Except my archers really aren't shooting very much, are they? Okay, doing them some of this. All right, send some of them guys out. Okay, that... Oh, these... I sent the... Um, yeah, these guys are going to be a problem then. Because these are missile guys. All right, here, fire. Okay, that was a bad call on my part. All right, um, okay, shield... Sword and shield guys, sword and shield guys. Okay, and some strength here, and some the ballista. Okay, that's actually a tricky situation right there. All right, and it looks like they're offering me some money. Yeah, I think I'll take the money. Yeah, there's another game I've been playing recently that, uh, well, it's kind of legacy, and I think it handles things a lot better because it gives you... Kind of gives you control there. It tells me I can upgrade one, by the way. I might as well upgrade the first guy because he's the one I'm using the most, right? All right. And I guess one more of those and then he's going to upgrade again. All right. So let's just exit from that. All right. Why don't we just uh, go over to the map and see if we can get some more money uh, generation going here with some invasions. All right. I'm guessing that I should probably go after four. So let's go after four. Oh, or is this? Uh, oh, did I get this one already? And I just didn't upgrade it. Oh, I don't have any. I don't have enough money to do that, do I? All right. Well, then why don't we go? Well, actually, that was three. This is four. Gotcha. Invasion cost three. Okay, let's go. I was confused by that. The placement. All right. Is that all I got? Can I pick something? Okay, that just looks a little weird right there. I mean, it didn't even give me the option of the other guys, you know? All 
Okay, they got a tower. Okay, a little bit of strength there. Okay, I noticed the tower doesn't shoot very often. Not that I'm having a problem with that. Alrighty. And they ran into... Okay, I guess it's not important. Okay, Italian Swordsman, Mercenary, Unlocked. Does, do I get to use those? Oh, okay, I have to spend uh, gems for them, I guess. Or maybe to upgrade them? I have no idea. All right, why don't we try... Oh, first of all, I did get some money, so upgrade that one. All right, and I have this one. I can't do anything with that because I just don't have money right now. Let's try five. Right, five right over here and see what we have. Can I do something with this? Roman Spearman? I mean, can I add those? Oh, oh, I get you. All right, so in other words, I can add units that I have, but it's going to increase the cost of the invasion. Okay, well, that's fine as long as I have extra guys there, right? All right, so I guess as over time... Hold on a second. Any more? No? Okay. I guess over time I'll have more and I can just add them. All right, why don't we try this invasion? Hopefully it goes a little bit better. Okay, that's a little better. All right. Of course, the... Um, okay, we got one archer back there. Okay, that worked out all right. You're in a lot of trouble back there. And a little bit of a damage boost there. We will get through your fence. Yeah, you in the back. I'm sure there's a place somewhere you could be hitting. Maybe you could reach over and hit that archer, you know, in the face with your sword or something. Okay, and then, of course, now we're doing this fighting, but apparently it doesn't matter. That's strange. Very strange. All right, well, apparently we need money in order to get things going here. Like, how much is this one? Yeah, I, I don't have enough money to even do one little bit here. So let's go back to the waves and see if we can get some money over here. I believe 20 should be a very special one, like a boss fight or something. So let's just uh, let's keep it going because I need money. All right, I'm going to put the swords guys up as soon as I see somebody. Yeah, all right, put him up. Even though this guy is not going to get anywhere near. Yeah, he's not getting anywhere near there. All right. And send out another group. Because. And damage. And shoot. Okay, run back, guys. Run back. They'll follow you. No, 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 no. Fire. Kill them. Okay, and I'll just deploy another one. Because I'm not seeing any cavalry here. And if I put the, um, the pitchfork guys out... Okay, here we go. If we put the pitchfork guys out, then they're susceptible to the missile guys. All right, and we got some good money for that. That's okay. All right, so let's just keep it rolling because uh, I'm also going to get some gems if I get all the way over there, right? And I want to use that money for investing. Okay, that's definitely not the pitchfork guys. So send in the sword and shield guys. If I could just get them to hang out by those flags, that would be great, you know? Here, fire. And send out another group. And a little bit of boost there. And shoot. That's not doing a lot of damage. Didn't even hit that guy. And a little bit of extra damage there. I thought for a moment these guys had grown a brain. How silly of me. See, they're out of archer range. That's the thing. Keep going. He'll follow you. Ugh.
kind of frustrating. Oh, more money. Well, more money is kind of important. All right, because money is kind of important. As a matter of fact, I'm going to go back to the map and I'm going to work on money generation here. Let's see here. How much money do I have? Okay, that one is maxed out now. What about this one? That one is maxed out. And what about you? Okay, and that one is maxed out. And I still have a thousand left over. Maybe I should hit somebody else. Now, I want to get to um, level 20. We're at 19 right now. The thing about it is none of these are actually going to help me. I guess I could add another archer. But, you know, I'm probably better off saving and upgrading the units. Because they're the ones who are actually getting out there and doing something. Yeah, I mean, the tower isn't really doing very much. The archers barely get a chance to hit anybody. And they're nowhere near the wall. So it just seems to be a waste of money. So we'll just do another wave. This is going to be 19. All right, let's just send the sword and shield, guys. If they would just hang out by that flag, that'd be great. And send another group. Damage. Fire. I mean, that doesn't seem to be doing anything. Keep going. Okay, that guy would be hard to... He's, he's throwing stuff, so he would be a problem. But if they just have, like, a, a pitchfork or a sword... Yeah, run back to the fence, you know? Okay, damage boost. Now you run. A couple of seconds of damage boost, and that's when you run. All right, you know what? Send more. And I'm very close to being able to send more after that. Get fire. And send some more. And that's it. Okay, one more. All right, this is going to be level 20. Looks like I'm going to get some gems, but it's probably going to be a boss fight. So hopefully I get a lot of money for this so I can upgrade. Oh, it's saying I can upgrade... The, I don't use them very much at this point. I'm thinking getting that last upgrade for the first one is probably a better idea, so I'm just going to save my money. Hopefully, this will give me enough money to do that. All right, let's do the next wave. All right, this is probably going to be hard. So I'm going to send out the Sword and Shield guys now. Oh, that's not good. Okay, send out the, um, the other guys. All right. Oh, that was... They, they lured me in. Okay, that's a problem. They lured me in. Okay, can we have some more horsies? Before these guys are all dead, that is. Okay, fire. Alright, I need to send sword and shield guys. And send them. Alright. Okay, that's a problem. Fire. Okay, it looks like the uh, tower is a little bit better if they're nearby. Oh, that is really, really bad. Okay, because I'm not going to have anything for a while here now. Okay, maybe I should work on the fence a bit, huh? Okay, um, t -t 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 very close, come on. Okay, what is that? that that's a big problem. Fire? Don't open the gate. For, okay. <laughs> They're using a battering ram on a closed gate. You know? Okay. That's a problem. All right. So here's the thing. Um, maybe I should work on the wall a bit. But oh, can I upgrade the other guys now? Oh, so close. So close. You know, but I got a lot of money for that. All right. So let's see. I had the uh, cavalry show up first. So I probably want to lead with the pitchfork dudes, right? I really want to hold on to that money. All right, let's just try this again. And I'm going to lead with the pitchforks. Because we're going to get uh, cavalry. All right, and I'm going to send these guys too. Okay, and they're all dead by the time the cavalry arrives, right? Okay, boost. Okay, where's the cavalry? Okay, is it random? 
Okay, if you guys could just stay near. Okay, they're in range. Okay, stop there. Oh, they're out of range now. All right, send some more of them. Okay, just stand there. Don't move. Okay, boost. Okay, is it random? Okay, because I had cavalry the last time. Now I don't. Okay, uh, quickly, quickly, quickly. Sword and shield, sword and shield. Go. Okay, they're going to drop that thing. Okay, fire. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Okay, so it was random. That was weird. Because I didn't get cavalry that time, but I do get some more money. The randomness of the units uh, appearing is going to make it very difficult to plan if you have problems with a level, you know. All right, so let's upgrade these guys here. All right, and um, I guess I would need one more to push them to the next level. All right, um, so I'm just going to do this for now. All right, well, they're upgraded. Why don't we do one more, and then maybe we'll go back to the map, and I think that'll probably be it. So let's do this. Oh, well, let me check. Okay, and send the sword and shield guys. And send some more. Okay, get close. Fire. Boost. Yeah, I really wish I could stop them from running all the way over there like that. Staying inside of um, archer range is really kind of important there, you know? And we'll send some more sword and shield. And boost. And shoot. Okay, and I get some more XP. Okay, morale check. You should run. I mean, it's six on one. Okay, we got some more guys over here. You guys should have gotten together. Okay, and a damage boost. And victory. Okay, and it looks like I can do a bunch of stuff here. Let's go back over here. All right, now this one... Uh, I, I, that requires level six. I can't do that. That one requires level 12. That one requires level 32. All right, this one here... Tower damage... I just don't see that one. One percent of like nearly nothing isn't really very useful. Increasing the range of the archers. I mean, they're way out of range, you know. So I'm thinking maybe we think big term here, you know. Money generation. Gold per colony. Well, that's going to help. Wall health, not an issue right now. Maybe more experience per kill. I mean, I do have three experience, right? So why don't we do that? Soldiers melee. You know what? Do that. It's pretty important, isn't it? And the units cool down. Sounds like a plan. All right, so there's all of my experience spent. And I have money. All right, so why don't we just go back to the map. We'll do one more of these, and I think that should do for now. So I guess we're heading for six. So let's do six. Hello. There we go. And, okay, so there. I guess there's five of them. All right, let's see. I guess they're level five. All right, let's go. It's not a very imaginative uh, type of a thing, is it? Uh, I noticed you stopped. Why did you stop? Keep hitting it. Hello. There we go. Okay, we have to beat these guys now? Okay, that's new, but it's actually smart. So I had a lot to deal with there, so I'm wondering if I need to have more units before I do that. Because you had the missile guys who were taking out my uh, pitchfork guys, 
who I was going to need for the, um, the cavalry there at the end. So I'm thinking two units just isn't going to do the job for that. So I probably have to wait until I do some more upgrades. Uh, speaking of which, I probably need to upgrade Peasant to a certain amount before I unlock, I guess, the Javelin guys. So I guess we're going to have to work on that. Anyway, I think that that is going to do for now. So uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to do more of this. I guess it comes down to what you guys want. If you want to see more of this, I'll do it. I do see that the game does have some issues. I mean, I would like to be able to give my guys orders saying, could you please not run all the way over here? Because I do have four archers here who would very much like to get some kills, you know? Um, and the other part, again, like the other one, the map thing, isn't overly um, friendly or imaginative or something like that, I guess. But And upgrading the walls, I mean, other than the battering ram the first time, nobody gets near the walls. Tower doesn't really seem to be very useful, and the archers are out of range, so it definitely has some issues. But you know what? I'm going to let you guys decide. If you want to see some more, give it a like, say so in the comments, and we'll do it. If you have other ideas for games... I am always willing to listen. So anyway, thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games, because games are fun. See ya!